every time I come in the kitchen, you in the kitchen. Blakey needs ya. Austin took it all, man. Fuck me this much. <laughs> fuck with man, I look up his exhaust and he turns the car and it just went fuck it. Oh my god. <laughs> I thought you had a big weekend or something. I, I told him I fully ran over gutter and fucked the exhaust. Can you just go see if it's like Put your face it's gonna be right? Well, well, you know how bad of a driver is. Oh, I was like, so fuck it. Oh, oh, yeah. It actually worked out perfectly. <laughs> <laughs> you only flew up. Only a feed cunt. <laughs> <laughs> Fun Austin sucks right. shit. Oh, alright man, we'll get back to it. Oh, yeah, just give Austin a call if you need to. Yeah, yeah, I'll just grab one. Some of the Enjoy. Oh, cheers. <laughs> well, that kicks off the show. Poor Rosty, eh? Today we're doing Beef Wellington. Oh yeah, that's right. It's almost Christmas time, that festive season. Let's try and have a go at this bad girl. Oh, yummy. Let's get started. First, you know the drill. Beer. Already cracked it straight into it. Ha! Okay, we've got a little bit of flour left. Take this off Austin's face a bit earlier. Yeah! Right, so, season. This has been sitting out for about an hour. There's room temperature. Especially something this thick could sit out for a bit longer, actually. Salt. <laughs> yeah, I think they're cleaning Austin up. You can hear him screaming. Pepper. <laughs> oh, poor Austin, eh? La 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 la! It's done. Put it in the side. Clean up your mess. Alright, so I've patted that down too with some paper towels as well. That moisture off. I've got about 700 grams of chopped uh, mushrooms, but I want it even finer. So I'll get my little friend back out. I don't want to sit here chopping all day. Look at the mess I'm going to make with this, ready? Oh, yep. Yeah. Yeah. No, get some in there, Blake, I reckon. <laughs> Perfect. That's what we want. Put him back in there. Get the other boys in. In. <laughs> Cowbunga. Mm, all right, grab yourself a pan. This one today. Oh, let that butter melt and then we'll chuck this bad boy in, try and get rid of all that moisture. And we'll go to our next stages of the Wellington. Stick around. In. A little mix. You want to get all that moisture out of it. Two bits of garlic. Hello, please. Mm. Good mix. Oh, smells good. Smells good, looks shit. Also, a little bit of rosemary. Just gonna cut it down a little bit. Mix. Get it all out. Bit of a thunderstorm in Australia today, eh? I hope you guys can hear it. It's not my belly, it's a storm. Ground pepper. In. A little bit of salt, mate, yeah? Pew. Just cook this for a few minutes. Three to four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve minutes. Minutes just to get all that moisture out. I want no moisture at all. Ends up turning into almost like a dry paste. <laughs> Yummy! Guys, it's been about seven to eight minutes. Finally dried out. Pushing down. Not much moisture. Heat off. Grab yourself a bloody bowl, mate. The rain outside. Put on a chick flick and have some wine and watch the notebook in the rain. Yeah! Open that up. Let that cool down. Give your pan a wipe down. Nothing crazy. Got all those herbs and flavors in there. And we're going to sear this ribeye. Flame on! Oh, all the copper. Got a big old dog here. Once that heats up, we'll chuck her in. Only searing it about a minute on each side and the ends as well. Locking in all those flavors. And then to the next part. <laughs> Man, that light. We've been dank for a while now. Still, go, still going through problems. All right. Big dog in. Yummy, yummy. What are you following me for? Fuck off, man. Oh, that's what? See all sides. See all sides. See all sides. Make sure you get the socks. Peter, it is pissing outside. Have a look, shall we? 
Australia. And kangaroos running into the pool. Get those kangaroos out of there, mate. All right. Oh, look at that big sexy mama. Let it just sit there and think about what you've done. All right. And then we'll be rubbing some Australian mustard. Not French, not American. Not American. No, American. Well, I can't do American. Not American. Not American, dude. Not French. Australian. Base it while it's hot to get all this locked in. Oh yeah. Da Vinci that bitch. Once that cools down a bit, get rid of the paper towel, I'll flip it and do the other side. But while you're waiting, top up your bloody drink, would ya? Best part of cooking, guys, that you can just get fucking pissed as. Alright guys, I've got a little bit of parsley. Well that's cooling down. into a mix and go on. Yummy! All right guys, a little bit of plain flour. Put this down here. A puff pass through. <laughs> Stick it in. Right, I've added a bit to this because they're a bit too short with the uh, puff pastry. Get our prosciutto down, shall we? Okay, we will. We'll lay these. The last bit had to be a little fucker, didn't it? I'm just gonna put a bit of flour on this. Roll it. Roll it a bit. Roll it. Now, my mushrooms. I get a nice even layer. And this is a big old dog. And we want to brush again, but I need to clean my fingers. Right. Back to Peyton. Guys, on my third, fourth beer, whatever it was. I should have had the plastic rolled out. Duh. Where is it? Fuck. Whoa. Whoa, slow down, buddy. You know what? Fuck it. We'll do it over here. <laughs> Alright. Let's pinch. Pinch these ends. Yours? They usually transfer it over here, but I fucked up. Little bad boy. Oh, look how happy he is. Alright, there you go. That was a big old butt. Wellington. Now I'm gonna put this in the fridge. You can put it in there for an hour or two or half an hour. I'm gonna put it overnight. Best effect, and I'll see you guys tomorrow when I'm not as drunk, all right? Put on a plate, put in the fridge. Night, little fella. Night. And I'll see you tomorrow, and we'll do the rest, all right? So watch, it'll be like this. And I'm back. All right. Woo. Let's get this out, eh? Day two. Come on, little. My precious. Have a look at it. I'm excited. This just got off the boat from Colombia. It's our pure cocaine and game. It's our raveler, and then we're going to... Egg wash it, season it, and the big girl. That's uh, that's been on at 2.30, heating up. Oh, it's done to do what? Oh. Hmm, how's it going? Well, I'm not very good artistic-wise, or anything making a pretty, but let's put a little, little something on top of the big fella, right? I was gonna do a penis. I thought, no, Blake, be mature. Let's just wing it, eh? Not very straight, eh? Oh well, you get that in the big jobs. Some bullshit like that. You can put whatever you want on the top. I'm gonna make mine like a little footy ball. Actually enjoy myself. Voila! All right, egg. Yolk. Get out. Ugh. Have fun doing that. Let me brush that up. Brush her up, buddy cup. Makes it nice and golden when she cooks. My little baby. My little baby. Salt. Don't be shy. A little bit of baking powder. Now. 
Oh, fuck. Shut up onto there. Ooh. Now we we'll chuck her in for about half an hour and then let it sit for about 10. See you, mate. Have a good day at school. Bye. In. About half an hour, check on her, and we'll be having beef wellington in no time. Smells so good in here, let's get this fucking Wellington out of here. There you go, Big Bertha. This is gonna be fun. <laughs> this is gonna be fun. <laughs> now, you wanna get it out off the tray and let it cool down for at least 10 minutes. Get that off into here. Well, that was easy. <laughs> Woo! 10 minutes, guys, and we'll cut into it and serve up. All right, guys, there we have it. A beef wellington, it's been rested for over 10 minutes now, and now's the exciting part. Hopefully it's medium red. All right, guys, let's cut into the bad girl. Egg. Oh, have a look at that. Have a look at it. Oh, dear Lord. Spot on a lakey. All right, do a couple more cuts. <laughs> oh, yummy. Yummy. There you have it, guys. Beef Wellington. Oh, if you could smell it. Delish. Just in time for Christmas. Try that one for your family. For yourself. A little bit to it. A little bit tricky, but in the end result, have a look at it. Have some fun with it, guys. I'm going to dig into this right now because I've been waiting and I'm so hungry. So let's have some. Guys, you all know, all of you new here, I love rare meat. So if you want to cook it, go another 15 minutes longer and then set out for 10 minutes. But this is how I like my meat, so each to their own. Oh my god. Wow. Alright, surprised myself there. I feel like it's Christmas already in my mouth. That's so good. I'm Blake Melvin, guys. Thanks for tuning in to Uncut Kitchen. I'll see you next episode. I am out of here. I think I just rolled my ankle. Uh.